I am going to do what I do best. And I'm going to yoink content and put the names of bigger streamers in my title. So today we are going to be reacting to Tim the Tatman, why I didn't finish Black Clover. Basically had a few shonens, a few animes under his belt, and I gave my two piece on a lot of them. And he couldn't get through uh, Black Clover because he said, I hate Ask the Voice. And I don't blame him. Ask the Voice is annoying. He's like, ah! It's like, bro, okay, chill, chill, chill. And that was like for five straight episodes. He was just screaming nonstop. And I think the, the animators and the producers like, okay, I, I, okay, the, the fans are speaking. They don't want him screaming as much. Okay, we'll tone it down. So I think they did do that. And now the anime is like on hiatus and it ended off on like a good note. So yeah, I, I actually want to see where Tim left off because there's a lot of good arcs in Black Clover. It's, it's I, I say it's very comparable to Naruto and it's done better because it's a new age shonen. It has better pacing. Sometimes the animations for the fight scenes are like, eh. But honestly, it's a good watch. It's a good watch. If you guys like Naruto Dragon Ball, if you guys haven't watched Black Clover yet, I definitely, definitely recommend Black Clover. But as a first few anime, probably not. So I want to see what Tim the Tatman thinks about Black Clover and why he didn't finish it. So let's get to it. I get a lot of questions about Black Clover. A lot of people ask me why I stopped watching it. So what we got for you here in this video is me explaining my take on Black Clover. Now, here's my predictions. I didn't pre-watch this, right? So if I'm right, do not spam pre-watch, all right? One, Asa's voice is annoying. Two, I think he didn't like the fan service or he hates the relationship with um, Noelle and who's the other girl? I, I think he hates um, the shipping of them. Like they try to force the other girls to like Asa and Asa's just oblivious. It took forever to build up into a decent fight. I think those are the three things. If you like Black Clover and you enjoy this kind of anime, the style of anime, I'm very happy for you, okay? Please hear me at the front of this video. This is my opinion and just how I feel about things that I enjoy. Can I ask why you stopped watching Black Clover? It's really crazy. You can't finish one of the most goaded animes. Mm, I don't know about one of the most goaded. I mean, like, look, I, I like Black Clover, right? It's good. It is good. But I don't think Black Clover really pushes the shonen medium like a lot of like the older or like newer um shonens like jjk like i i think jjk is probably like peak peak new age shonen so can i say that black clover pushes the medium for shonen anime in general probably not i think they really dive into a lot of the tropes right like every character like right, right in the squad it's like oh you have a drunk witch a very sexual drunk witch right you have a delinquent who's really loud you have a really quiet timid dude who wants to be friends with everyone but he can't because he's socially awkward right you have a horny dude for a sister right and that's all their tropes right like every time like they try to get their screen time they're saying something about their trope so like they really dove into the trope even though like they have separate arcs where they explore their backstories more it just felt so short comparatively to like every single time like hey i'm horny for my sister or like hey i'm a drunk which he 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 you shouldn't drink more you should relax more or like hey i'm gojo son i i i want to be friends it's like eh, i don't know I, I just personally don't think black clover is that goaded as this chatter would say what i have found in my anime viewing history is that pacing is an extremely important I knew thing it. I to knew me it. I knew in it. animes and what i mean that's by that's one of the things i said i said pacing to the good fights what I mean is, if a group is going from point A to point B, let's say they have to go from like their, their headquarters to a, a mission. The, the, the style of anime that I enjoy is basically like this. They wake up, they go, okay, time to get over there. And they head over and they get to the mission. And within two to three, maybe five minutes max, they're at the mission. What I don't enjoy is let's say that they decide that they have to go from headquarters to a mission. If after they decide that, they go outside and one of the characters gets into a tree and thinks about how the mission is gonna play out. Even that, I'm okay with. I'm all right. Like a main character kind of reflecting on the, the journey they're about to go on, I'm fine with that. But then they go to another character who's swinging in a hammock, reading and thinking about the mission. And then they go to another character thinking about the mission and how it's going to be. And then they go to another character thinking about how the mission's going to be. And then they go to another character and think about how the mission's going to be. Then they go to another character and they think about how the mission's going to be. And we are 10 to 15 minutes at this point of people thinking about the mission. Then this gets better. The next episode, they go shopping to get 
swimsuits for the mission. Wait, and then, what? Wait, 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 wait. What episode is Tim talking about? Was this a filler episode? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Was this when the Black Bulls went down underwater and like they had like their beach episode? Because every anime has to have a beach episode, right? Let's go to Crunchyroll and look at the thumbnails real quick, right? Let, let's just see because I, I need to make sure because I my, my, my mind is a little bit blurry. This is the beach episode. Is the pacing that bad in Black Clover as I remembered it? I felt like the first few episodes of Black Clover, like 1 through 50, they were good. But did they start slowing down with the elf arc? I'm like, oh my god. But I, I don't know. I don't know what Tim is talking about. Not only are they shopping, they go to each character about how they're thinking about getting certain swimsuits for the mission. And then there's three more episodes at the beach before going into the water no that's not true that's not true that's that's cap i'm fact checking this man i'm fact checking tim the fat man i mean tap man oh my god they actually do go for the swimsuits holy shit i don't remember this episode at all he's right okay they don't spend a full episode buying swimsuits it's like a third of the episode okay now they're at the beach so this is one here's the next episode okay they're at the beach still training this is their training arc. This is like a side training arc. This would be the last one. Two and a half episodes or three episodes until they finally get into the water. All right, Tim's base. My bad, Tim. It's my bad. I didn't mean to check you like that. My bad. Okay, he, he's right. I, and just to even just back up a little bit and just talk about what things I really don't enjoy in Black Clover, okay? Number one, Asta, annoying as fuck. I've never had a main, main character that I've watched more in my life that I've wanted to like die. Jeez. I can what the heck tim oh my god also i'm right he hated asta so that's two out of three i'm like oh my god he's like mada 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 <laughs> yelling for fucking hours man <laughs> hours <laughs> Tell me, the only people there were two people that were keeping me enjoying black clover two shows how long it's been since i watched it <laughs> other brother the cool brother if you will not asta you know you know cool i like you know i enjoy his style i think he's nice i don't know i enjoy you know so i was kind of interested in him i i don't I, i'm be honest here's a hot take i don't like you know he's he's a sasuke archetype he's like he learns things quickly he's kind of a chad kind of a sigma male he just good at everything he gets all the ladies and like he doesn't talk a lot and he doesn't try it's like, okay, dude, that's, I don't know. It, it just, he feels very like one dimensional. And out of nowhere, he's like, hey, yeah, I'm an ascendant of the queen of another kingdom. I'm like, cool, that's why you have all this power. It makes sense now. And in some animes, everyone will do the mission, come back to dinner, and the camera Say will kind of just pan out, right? And it's like a 10 to 15 second little, oh, we're panning out and they're eating. Not Black Clover, no. Black Clover wants to zoom in on each character yes. of the bulls and think about the food and think about yep. what the mission was like. So you go to Asta, he's like, man, what a heroic mission. That was great. I'm really glad that we got yep, to do I knew that. It. I said this before, but every character in the Black Bull has to have their piece. They have to have their screen time. They're gonna say some stupid thing that belongs in their trope. Such a time waster. And like, I think this proms derives from being a weekly shonen. I think if this anime wasn't a weekly shonen, it would be so much better. They just have to stretch out the screen time. They have to have the characters recycle their lines. It's like every character just have to have some weird thing that they say. You go to the little, the little girl that just fucking eats all the time and she's just fucking just eating. Charming, yeah. So like, just like this, she kind of just eats like that and she just keeps eating and like her little sheep are making shit. And then you go to, um, the 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 fire guy who i really wish that he got some more screen time in the first 57 episodes but he didn't the fire guy uh what's his name he seems actually kind of cool he's actually he's actually one of my favorite people to watch in the anime Mine. because he barely Mine fucking man. talks yeah. so i actually um magna no not magna the other guy the other fire guy that doesn't talk that's magna who is it or he's not fire is he fire he just doesn't talk much not gray not luck. No, it is Magna. I'm sorry. Luck is, it is Magna. No, yeah. not luck. Hey. Okay, now I'm out of huge distraction. Is is luck? Okay, bro. Okay. I have to back up. I don't blame Tim 
for struggling to remember all the characters, even though he's like 50 episodes deep in, right? In Shonen, you have so many characters for no reason that don't develop the plot. They're just side plots. It's just for world building. And there's so many ways to build the world without introducing 10 million characters. It's just so many characters. This is the problem with Black Clover. This is the problem with My Hero. This is the problem with Naruto as well. A lot of the big shonen don't know how to keep a tight core cast. Like, I think JJK does it well. They have a good core cast right now. They're not introducing a lot. They have the senseis, they have the students. They have a good tight core cast and they're gonna develop more. And I can't remember, I, I literally said Gosh. And I was thinking about this quiet mumbling dude. That's Gordon. Gosh is the horny sister guy. But yeah, it's just way too much characters. Way too much characters. Gordon! You see how long it took for you to remember who it was? That's an example of what I'm talking about. But anywho, Gordon, they kind of pan to him and he's like, I love this food. And then they go to Gray and Gray, thankfully, doesn't talk much, but Gray has to be eating. And then they go to the little guy who loves his sister with yeah. the fucking mirror. Yeah, and he's Timothy like, oh, James. dude, Marie would love this food so much. No one touched Marie. And then <laughs> who else is in the bowls? Why was Ghost Trope ever created? I, I don't understand. Like the weird horny sister, like relationship thing is just so weird like his nose is bleeding like bro chill out that's literally your ch like little sister oh my god like, i get this is like medieval times or something but like dude i saw someone in chat say it's character development no that is not character development their character development is when they finally get their few episodes for their arc that is just filler screen time this is, that's a one head chatter i know he likes marie i get it you know how because they developed the character and i fucking know that I know. I don't need you to reflect on your sister every time you're eating. And I understand it's kind of like his thing. I get that. I do. I don't need to know that Oscar funny wants all. justice and wants to fight. And, and he's just a fighter because they've developed the character. I already fucking know that. And it's not just character development. It's, it's not because you look at an anime. Y'all know I love Attack on Titan, bro. Everyone knows I love it. Yep. Attack on Titan, they sit down at dinner, might be a back and forth for a second, bam, next next sequence. So maybe the biggest, here's, this might be the biggest issue. I think Attack on Titan might have ruined me. And what I mean by that is Attack on Titan was like a perfect anime for me. And that's my bar. Ooh, so that's yeah. now my, I'm not gonna. I definitely agree with Tim. Like if you watch New Age Shonen and you try to go back to watch Naruto, Dragon Ball Z, Bleach, you just can't. The pacing is god awful, absolutely god awful. And I think Black Clover, even though it's a New Age anime, it's following the footsteps of Weekly Shonen, like Naruto and Bleach. But that's that's the hard thing. Like, like if you try to introduce someone to like new animes, like do I recommend them? Like start them off like from the roots, or do I start them off like strong with like Attack on Titan, Death Note, or like JJK? It's it's hard to say because like then they go back to the older ones and like they can't appreciate it because the pacing is god awful. Watch an anime unless it kind of has a pacing or not even a storyline, just like a similar just timing of everything happening. Because there are some filler episodes in Attack on Titan. But even the filler episodes in Attack on Titan don't feel like filler episodes. I love Death Note. Everything about Death Note flows so well. How do you know I like Tokyo Ghoul? Great pacing. Love don't it. watch Tokyo Ghoul. Don't watch Tokyo Ghoul. Don't listen to Tim. Tim doesn't Tokyo know Tokyo Ghoul, about. I'd almost uh, say borderline mm -hmm. too fast, to be honest with you. I think Tokyo Ghoul could have been another. That's fair if you're talking about season three, because like they were just going like Bam, 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 fight, 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 fight. And they weren't explaining anything going on. I'm like, whoa, 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 what? I, 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 I gotta flip through the manga. Like, what, what's, what's going on? You're trying to keep up? And it's like, what the fuck? It's just so many twists and like, it's not built up properly at all. Tokyo Ghoul was almost like too fast. I was like, holy shit, like what's happening? But the, I, I, I enjoyed Tokyo Ghoul, I did. So it really, that that is why, and I understand this is now like an anime rant. <laughs> And I just want to say, I've said this a couple of times because I think people aren't going to hear me. If you enjoy Black Clover, I'm really glad that you love Black Clover. And if you enjoyed like Hunter Hunter, I'm really glad for you. But I cannot, I cannot, I can't. I, I just can't get through it, literally. So that is why I stopped watching Black Clover. You know, Tim, haven't watched Naruto yet? Yeah, yeah. Naruto is a lot though. Naruto for sure is a lot. Like, look guys, Naruto is my favorite anime. And I, at the time when I reacted to Tim and Tatman, I'm like, damn, he really didn't like Naruto. But I'm like, I'm not gonna fucking like send death threats towards Tim. Like, I love Tim. Tim. Tim's a great guy. Like, even with any stranger, right? Like, if you don't like a certain anime, here's, here's the thing about me. I don't make it my whole personality. 
I make it part of my personality, okay? But it's not my whole personality, okay? So I don't get offended when people are like, Naruto sucks, or Naruto's D tier, or Naruto's F tier. I'm like, okay, cool. You don't like it, you don't like it. You, you don't like it because of the plot holes, some of the characters, there's too much characters and whatnot. Like, that's that's fine. At the end of the day's opinion, I just like talking about anime. I like, you know, asking and talking about animes and hearing people's anime opinions, and that's it, because I love the medium. I appreciate the medium, and I don't make it my whole personality, so I don't get bets because someone says this is bad or this is good.